welcome back, toy hunters, to another episode of Toy Jizz, where we go nuts <coughs> all over Hot Wheels and other die-cast model cars, action figures, and the coolest collectibles. Today, we're going on our normal route. We're hitting up some Dollar Generals. We're hitting up some Walmarts. Um, spoiler alert, I don't come across anything too great. However, I do happen to find for the first time the Hal Jordan parallax figure from McFarland Toys. Um, so I guess that's kind of the plus of the day. Um, anyway, guys, without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump on into it. We're starting out at a Dollar General, and uh, you guys, you know, we know. You know, I know, we all know, we can just feel it. It's, you know, kind of like the force almost. We're gonna take, ooh. No soup for you! Yeah, we know. Is that Acura NSX? Now, hey, now I've seen plenty of these, the uh, Sierra Cosworth. Um, that's an Escort. That's an 80s Escort. We all know, we've seen those Escorts, those boxy little Escorts. You're not fooling anybody. Don't try and church it up, son. You know, they're peg warmers, and there's, um, the kit super pursuit mode once again it's over um it's over you know if uh hot wheels doesn't teach you anything it should teach you about basically um group think and kind of inflating the value of certain things that aren't really uh worth anything um you know i mean that's that's hot wheels in and of itself period but, uh, you know, sometimes it's uh, played up a little bit more than other times. You know, do you get what I'm saying there? I don't know. Maybe maybe I'm not totally explaining that right. Anyway, what I'm getting at is um, it's over with Kit, the Super Pursuit mode. Um, anybody who supposedly wanted it, if they don't have it by now, uh, they, they didn't want it in the first place. Now we're kind of at this uh, mom and pop. Um, I can't honestly... Oh wait, or uh, yeah, yeah. This is this mom and pop thing, and um, you know, here's some uh, ten packs. Here's some Matchbox, some older stuff that doesn't really look super, you know, exciting. That Miata, that black Miata again, but whatever. Um, some premium cars, but they'll look pretty gone through. Nothing I'm interested in. Honestly, I'm here just kind of killing some time, getting some footage. Uh, we're now moving on real quick to another Dollar General. And, dude, look at this hot garbage. We'll give her a, click, a quick flip through uh, just for you guys, obviously. Uh, but... Yeah, I'll bet there's nothing here worth getting. Hey, here's another one of the uh, Cosworths. No thanks. Guys, after I got um those Zamix, the... Uh, uh, bah, 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 bah. The electric Mustang Zamex now, it's like, great. The uh, collector mentality in me is like, well, now I gotta buy those fucking other electric Mustangs too now, right? So I got a full set, right? Uh, y you know how it goes. I'm not the only one who does shit like that, right? Uh, and here's some of the little haulers. Eh, I'm not interested. Um, let's take a look at their matchbox. Now, you already know what's going on here. I already know what's going on. Um, this is kind of a lot of full stock that hasn't really been moving. We've seen it be this way for quite a while now. It is what it is. Um, sometimes I just kind of give her a little flip through for fun. Now, um, we are at Walmart and kind of looking at some Jadas. Um, and... Some Fast and the Furious cars. 
Here's the auto worlds. And honestly, the auto worlds, a lot of times you see a lot of these cars sitting there. And they're just really... Now, I kind of... Hmm. I was about to say they're not that appealing. Meanwhile, some of those... I almost kind of like that greenish car. Almost? I don't know. I don't know how I feel about that car. Um, but I mean, uh, most of these premium cars, unless it's the, hey, it's the super, and hey, I could sell this maybe online for 50 bucks. Um, what's the, the actual value in it, quote unquote, to me, is just finding it for a video. You know, I mean, I'm almost to the point with a lot of this where, hey, if I were to even find the super, I might not even buy it. Like with these tech decks, now I haven't, as far as I'm aware, I haven't, you know, found the super on the tech decks themselves yet. Meanwhile, um, on the, uh, the Hot Wheels, uh, little skateboards, I can't think of what the hell they call those right now off the top of my head. We'll take a look at them here in a minute. Maybe just Hot Wheels skate. I don't know. Um, I found, I found a handful of those supers. Well, I'm sorry, not supers, just the treasure hunt. I don't know if there is a super. I think it's just a treasure hunt on those. Anyway, um, I mean, at three bucks a shot, I don't even know what they're going for on, you know, online. Um, it seems like they're not as rare as other, um, you know, treasure hunts and super treasure hunts. Um, at three bucks a shot, I don't think they're even worth buying. Um, that's just my two cents on that little gimmick. Um, here's uh, a Baja bouncer hauler or some bullshit. These cars, again, you know, if I were to find one with a little silver sticker on it, again, that'd blow my skirt up. Otherwise, it's like, eh, I think I'm going to save my money. Yep, there's the Keaton Batmobile again. Spoiler alert, today's still not the day I buy that. Now, whoo, some kid went through this shit like the Tasmanian Devil or something, man. Just threw all this garbage in there. Okay. Uh, that's probably a good indicator of... Uh, what we can expect. Uh, here's some five packs. The Jurassic World five packs. Uh, anyway. Uh, you know you know what's up with those cars. We got what we want out of them anyway. Uh, maybe I'll take a look at them later. Um, let's get some of this garbage out of here. And then uh, maybe. You know we're here. We're going to take a look at these cars. Why wouldn't we? There's the Lambo. Eh, I mean, I don't know. We'll see. Maybe, maybe some of this is worth taking a look at. But man, it seems pretty, seems pretty beat, don't it? But I mean, there is some stuff on the bottom that doesn't look uh, disturbed yet. So I mean, in a way, who am I kidding? That's not a good sign. Like, like there's any supers or uh, you know treasure hunts or anything like that on the bottom row of that. Come on, come on now. Oh, there's the uh, minivan. Yeah, I, I think I'm good on that. There's another mystery model. I don't... I almost looked at some of those, but um, it just kind of felt like such a huge waste of time. I don't even really look at those. Like, maybe I'll, I'll give it a little feel up. Uh, but they're, they're not worth even messing around with. The Broken Promises uh, mod rod. Um, there's a part of me that likes that, but I'm going to leave it. Hey guys, while I'm thinking about it, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to Humane Garbage if you like this video and would like to see more of them.
I mean, there's there's a lot of fantasy cars up here. Meanwhile, there are some decent cars here. I mean, this isn't like a totally, you know, picked over deal. Um, I mean, I've seen a lot of these cars. I don't know if I'm really going to pick up a whole lot of these. And I mean, it's it's definitely been gone over. I'm not like going through this. Now, here's a, a twin mill. That's one of the um, supers. I'm not, I'm sorry, not a super, but one of the fantasy cars, K Case. Um, that's kind of grown on me. Um, oh, and there's the Lambo lately. The white Lambo. A little reminiscent of uh, maybe Miami Vice and or um, Vice City. Yeah, they're they're kind of reminiscent of each other there, ain't they? Um, let's take a look at. Uh, here's some dinosaurs. Here's the Buzz Lightyear stuff that just sat. Ha ha ha! Fuck you, Disney. Here's some GI Joe stuff. No, ooh, check this out. That's kind of cool, actually. He's like some Cobra bad guy, dude. Now that. For 43 bucks, though, I mean, damn, dude. I just I just feel, though, in particular, they've really priced themselves out of even being accessible. Now, there's uh, Hal Jordan's Parallax. They got, like, three of them. Huh. Trippy main. There's a Batman and a Superman. Another Batman variant. Another Batman variant. Like, Batman in a trench coat. It's kind of a, you know... Kind of a gimme when you think about it. Now here's all these uh, superpowers with Farland toys, and it still is not a great sign to me that those are just so racked up. Nobody seems to really be buying those except me, and I got two Superman and two Batmans, and I'm I'm probably good, guys. I don't know if you're gonna get me again on that. Some Star Wars toys. Now, some of these uh, supposedly have, like, chases. Um, so, I'm trying to take a look for those. Here's some more detailed action figures for 25 bucks a shot. Some robot. I mean, I do like those action figures. It's just, I'm not into Star Wars like I once was. I even saw that show, and I'm still not into it that much, you know. It's like, for 25 bucks for an action figure, you know, maybe I'll just uh, take a look at it. And if I feel the need again, maybe I'll just look up a picture of it online or some shit, you know. 46 bucks again, I kind of, there's a part of me that wants that Millennium Falcon, but for 46 bucks, I think I'm going to skip it. And I'm not seeing any um, chase sticker. You know, what's nice about these chase stickers is um, they're usually kind of some metallic, so they do kind of pop right out at you, you know. Here's some wrestling action figures and some other whatever stuff. Now, now check this out at this Walmart. This is the new wave, I swear, of McFarlane DC figures. There's The Rock. Um, you know, this is from the Black Adam movie. And this is their clearance. This is their clearance, um, like, stuff. Like, they've got... Uh, the economy is so bad that basically, hey, um, they've got so much stuff already... They've got stuff coming in. They've got so much stuff coming in. They put it on the clearance aisles right away out in the middle of the aisles because they've got so much garbage just coming in. They don't know what to do with it, and it's not moving. You know, again, um, from the Black Adam movie. And see, here's... They got um, on the superpowers. Now, good news, guys. They got a, they got a black guy uh, superhero, too. So the blacks are represented... And look how these are moving. It looks like they, I mean, maybe they got some other Supermans and Batman somewhere. But they even doubled up on the Black Green Lanterns, it seems. And they're not moving. And it's it's not a good sign, guys. 
Uh, but not to try to end it on a sour note. Anyway, guys, that's all I've got for you this time. A pretty lackluster um, hunt. But that's how she goes. That's how she goes. Um, if this is your first time watching a Humane Garbage video, please hit the subscribe button and click the bell to get notifications of new videos sent directly to your phone and inbox. Follow us on social media and stay tuned for another video from Humane Garbage.